Hello, everybody. Now, over the last uh, week or two, I finished all of Doorways the Underworld, which was kind of a bummer of a game because it didn't live up to the hype that the first two chapters created. But I figured, you know, I'm going to be going to Austin in, in, you know, a couple of weeks now. It's going to be the uh, 13th I'm leaving town. And actually, in a couple of days here, I'm going to be shipping off my computer, so I'm not going to be able to, to continue to upload videos. But I might do, like, you know, YouTube uh, stuff, um, just like compilations and junk, if I can. I don't know, we'll see. But I thought we would get into something a little more lighthearted since, you know, Doorways the Underworld was kind of a bummer. So let's go ahead and uh, get into something here. Just some good, high quality, lighthearted fun. So let's see how all our friends are doing. How oh, they're already moving around. <laughs> Ducky's gone. Yeah, you know, people ask me why do you, why do you why would you keep playing the game? Because fuck that game. Seems like it sucks a lot. <laughs> you guys, you think you know? You think you know? You don't. This is the best game ever, and is totally just a complete relax fest. Snore. <laughs> you want to know the secret to relaxing while you're playing this game? The secret is drinking heavily. To all the kids out there, don't drink heavily. Uh, actually, to all the adults out there, don't drink heavily either. Your friends are going to have problems with you. Hey, Dougie did the beard. Where'd Dougie go? Where's the cutest little ducky I've known in all my many years as a duck? Extraordinaire! Where the fuck he is, Ducky? Oh god! They're just gonna hide. I don't know where Ducky went. I don't know where Ducky went. Ducky's gonna eat my brains. Let's see. Uh, 2 a.m. Let's see if I can. Uh, it's 3 a.m. now, actually. Uh, if I can do math right, that means I only have six more hours to go. Right? That's how math works. I'm not scared of shit. <laughs> you think? I'm gonna let some fucking toy duck thing that just stands there creepily ogling my eyeballs get the better of me. I'm not, because I've got Angry Orchard, brought to you by Five Nuts of Freddy's. Angry Orchard, for the best in all your apple cidery junky stuff. Oop. Hi. <laughs> Not even worried here. I'm worried. They're all gone. Think I can make it to the six with both the doors closed? Probably. Let's just leave it. Let's just see how this goes. Man, that power is draining really fast. I can't do that. 4 a.m. And I'm gonna be okay. I'm not gonna die, I'm gonna live forever, forever and ever till the end of my life, which will be approximately three seconds from now. One, two, three, yay, I made it past the three seconds I had previously said. Maybe I'll be okay, but I'm probably gonna die. I'm scared, can't control the cameras. I'm gonna die, it's fine. Find three percent power left. That's enough to last the rest of the night, right? Let's just dip. Just in case the fucker from the east decides he wants to come to the I'm down to zero percent power. Ah, uh, nope, I didn't make it. Let's drink. Hi, buddy. Listen, I got a proposition for you. Feel free to take this however you want. You leave me alive, I'll give you all of the stuffed goods that you could ever desire. Is that a yes? That's a no. Well, that was fun. Let's give something else a shot. Um, something um, that's, you know, just as, as happy and inspiring and full of joy. Okay, daylight. That's a fun one. Let's, let's go for it. So excited! Why? 
game appears to be broken. Now, where did it leave off? I approximately left off at the zero, where nothing was going on, because I think I just didn't get very far in this game. Okay, let's pick up these lighters. Yay, glow sticks. Okay, picture of a dead cow. That's normal. I like to dance when I run. It goes something like this. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. What do you say? Prisoner 52. Seems to be experiencing visions of shadow people. Doctors on site keep trying conventional therapies, but I believe we need to start thinking about new procedures that push what we've come up with to date. I just confused myself with how I read that. Dr. Mercer, nurse visitors complain that early William Ferris disappears for hours in a time during shifts, and when he finally shows up, his hands and the knees of his pants are as dirty, as though he's been digging out in the dirt. When she asked him about it, he seemed confused and asked where he could be. This is the four complaining two weeks. The baby fairs, and I think the mayor's the best lady, you to Percy. Just make sure people are doing their job and not screwing around in the boiler room. George certainly has a lot to say about people screwing. Why did I just do that? That was a bad idea. And a horrible, terrible waste of time. Hi! You seem nice. And shy, disappearing off into the darkness. Threat, uh, approximately half moon. Whatever that means. Into the darkness. Into the darkness. Going into the darkness with my lit up glow stick. Again, you're wondering what the secret to uh, being perfectly calm while you're playing a game like this I is? I know there's somebody here. Well, the answer, Sangry Orchard, brought to you by Daylight. The game of the chosen people of this Oh, hi. What are you doing down there, you silly little Billy? I can't pick you up because I lack the ability to crouch. Patient suffers from a hoarding problem, frequently hiding items she can get her hands on. A patient has been observed clutching objects and mumbling to herself in nonsense phrases described by the staff as disturbing, but the staff's a bunch of pricks and they don't know what they're talking about anyway. It's the subtext in the, the note. I appear to be stuck and cannot move. Okay, I got myself out. With a little bit of magic, a little bit of wiggling, and you can get yourself out. Yeah! Squeaky lady! Squeaky! I don't have a flare. I'm boned. Let's just run. Running seems good. Let's use this. Let's use... Let's... Let's use this. Flare! Ah. Let's see you come at me now. Just try it. Boogie, boogie, boogie. The threat appears to be in the dark. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't understand this threat assessment uh, system that they've got going on here. Should I be worried? Should I be pooping myself right now? Is pooping myself a natural reaction to this uh, event? Dr. Wagga's rig community removal of all positions from person. <laughs> Patient became violent during extraction. She seemed particularly fixated on an old doll and cried for days after its removal. What a baby. Anyway, it's probably not making the situation any better calling the, the lady that wants to kill us a baby. I would like to Twitch stream this game eventually. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was what? Didn't I just close you? Or did I just open you? Ah, doors are opening behind me. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. So very screwed. So very screwed because the lady wants to kill me. Da 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 Going to the bright light and stuff. Going up the stairs. Going up the stairs. Going even further up the stairs and stuff. I don't remember getting this far the last time I played. I must have just really sucked. Or maybe I did get this far. I seem to remember running into a lot of corners. Going down the stairs. Going down the stairs. Nothing better be down the fucking stairs. Why can't I get the thing out of the door? It's just a simple moving procedure. 
It's what the human hands were made for. I fear that with the upcoming closure of the hospital, we will be unable to find a home for her ourselves. It's sad that a life brought into this world under such violence will now become a ward of the state. She will undoubtedly be bounced between institutions. Hey, look at chair. You know, sometimes when you're just, you know, you're doing things in your life, and you forget that there's, there's simple things that we, we all just take for granted, like chairs, man. But then you know, there's crazy whispering, and you decide that that's it's not really worth it. Fuck chairs. There was a used thing just a second ago. Hey, I found a teddy bear. Cool. Throw it at the ghost. This could be Rose. <gasps> what the hell? Sure, that's nothing. Can it be? Haven't made it this far. Have I mentioned that? I see you. What the? <laughs> that's normal. That's nothing. You know, little temporal shifts. Those happen all the time. They're just not reported very often because people think that, you know, they're gonna think I'm c c c c c crazy Which is not always the case. You gotta find yourself a Time Lord. He'll believe that shit. Patient reported seeing shadowy figures in his room at night. Staff has been advised to indulge Patient in his delusions in order to avoid the aggressive behavior. <laughs> patient 15. Patient remains- oh, I missed it. I clicked too soon. Hey, there's stuff in this direction. Should I run blindly towards it? Sure. See? Everything works out swell when you just run blindly towards things. Saving? That's glorious. Do you guys want to see more of the daylight? And I go, because tonight I'm going to hold you so close. So, would you guys like to see more of this? Uh, like I mentioned, I'm going to be in Austin for a while. Let me read this note. Attention all employees, we understand that it is difficult to make it outside on your 10 minute breaks. However, just because the records room is large and has high ceilings does not mean you can move things about and create a satellite break room for smoking. We have got several staff members moving supply crates, stacking them precariously and climbing over them to serve as a lookout. Be advised, this is not gym equipment. Climbing on crates of medical supplies will not be tolerated. Management. Do you guys want to see more of this? Um, I just wanted to, to, here, let's, let's, let's cut everything off for a second and go back into uh, what the point of this video was. So this has kind of been a, a, a temporary goodbye. I'm going to be heading out to Austin. And like I said, got to pack up my computer. So there's going to be like two weeks where you're not going to have new content at all. But, you know, I could still get onto YouTube and do like compilations or something with that if if if, 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 if so choose if you'd like to i've been wanting to do a horror compilation for a while and actually my brother has vegas pro on one of his computers so i could potentially make compilation videos this has been empty for a while now but let me know and um i i, I will I, i'll try to like record vlogs or something so you know what the progress is I'll be in Austin October 14th, and hopefully if I get my computer shipped out on time, then it will get there right when I arrive, and I can continue to make videos. Anyway, let me know what you think, and, uh, you know, leave a like if you've enjoyed this weird little, I don't know, I didn't even have any plans for this, I just kind of threw this shit together. So let me know if you like when I throw shit together. But yeah, I'll see you in a couple of weeks. Um, if you'd like to, I am on Facebook, G the Good Phosphor. So if you go to that page, I check it pretty regularly and we can stay in contact. I'd like to talk to you guys or if you post comments in any of the videos, I've been fairly good at responding to them. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you. Leave a like and uh, I'll see you in, in a couple weeks probably. Bye! Ah, the only way I can get through this apparently is to the Tells you how, how much they thought about it.